George Powell has been working on these wheels for over 10 years, and now we finally got an experimental pair for us to try out ourselves. What's up? This is Levi at Shred Shop, connecting you to skateboarding. And today, we are looking at the brand new Pal Peralta Dragon Wheels. As you can probably tell, these don't have the iconic dragon logo you know from these dragon wheels from when you've seen them all around the internet. Pal Peralta sent us these mystery wheels, just saying experimental on them. But as it turns out, these are actually a test pair of the new dragon wheels. In this video, we're gonna talk about what these wheels are and why everybody's talking about them. We're gonna go over the technical aspects of this wheel, and I'm also gonna give you my thoughts after riding these wheels for a whole week. Typically in skateboarding, if you know anything about skateboard wheels, your soft wheels will be the smooth rolling ones that have tons of grip and not a lot of slide. Like if you try to power slide, you'll usually end up sticking and falling forward. And then on the other hand, you have hard wheels. Now these are your skate park wheels because they have a rougher roll on rough concrete, but they also slide very well and are very maneuverable for reverting out of tricks if you don't land straight. With the new Dragon Wheel, Pal Peralta has claimed to create a wheel that has the smooth roll of a soft wheel, but also grips and slides like a hard wheel, making the best of both worlds for both street and park. For the last 10 years, George Powell has been doing research and development on the new Dragon Wheels, as well as testing with the team. Basically, what George Powell did with this wheel was create a high rebound wheel. These wheels rebound 18 to 20% higher than a regular wheel, making it super fast on all surfaces, but still allowing it to slide. Now we're gonna get into some of the more nerdy tech aspects of the wheel. Nerd! Currently, sorry, hello? Hey, are you gonna calm down drink? Yeah, in a bit. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> you can leave that in. Currently, these wheels only come in a 93A durometer. This is an interesting durometer because it's right in between a hard and a soft wheel. Typically, a soft wheel has a durometer of between 80 and 90, where a hard wheel will have a durometer between 95 and 101. So the love child, in the end, is the Powell Dragon Wheel. The Powell Peralta wheels just came to the market, so they only come in four sizes. There's a 52 millimeter wheel that's 31 millimeters wide, a 54 millimeter wheel that's 32 millimeters wide, Wide, a 54 millimeter wheel that's 34 millimeters wide, and a 56 millimeter wheel that's 36 millimeters wide. The 56 millimeter has more of a conical shape. That's it for the technical aspects of the wheel, but now we're gonna throw these on my board and see how they skate. After about a week of riding these wheels, personally, I don't think that I can go back to a normal wheel. After riding rough street spots, as well as skate parks, there's literally no reason for me to go back to a normal wheel, as I get the smooth roll I need on rough concrete, but I also get the slide I want whenever I'm on rough concrete or at a skate park, honestly. And weirdly, for being a soft wheel, they actually seem to slide better than most hard wheels. I am blown away, and I, honestly, I heavily doubted that these wheels would be any good. The only downside to these wheels, for me, was at first it felt really strange after being on a hard wheel since I started skateboarding to all of a sudden have this soft wheel with a high rebound. However, after skating these wheels for about an hour, I really got used to how the Dragon Formula felt and I... Oh. I love them. Over the last week, I also skated some DIY spots that had much more rougher concrete than a normal skate park. And on those parks, it genuinely felt like I was skating on skate park concrete. It was a smooth roll and I was able to easily pop my tricks. These wheels have done a great job of impressing me, Levi Switzer. We love hearing your feedback on this stuff, so if you got a pair of wheels yourself, make sure you comment down below what you thought of them. If you're on social media right now, make sure to follow us at Shred Shop or follow myself at Levi Switzer. This has been the first look at the brand new Pal Peralta wheel and stay tuned for comment of the week. 
Oh! We got a spicy one from our boy, Lewis Moffat. Lewis says, I am so keen to see what you come up with next. You have inspired me to become a taxidermist, but with humans. Lewis, I will gladly be your first client. 